Hey everyone, this is Steve with Entering in a Space, and it is October 1st, and tonight I want to do a quick little video on showing you guys how to use the plans mode in the ASI Air Pro. So what have we done outside? We have polar lined and we focused on the hydrogen filter. And so what we're gonna do here is we're gonna go over to the, uh, we're gonna do something different. We're gonna do a plans mode today. So we're gonna go over here to preview and come down here to plan. We're gonna hit the three little lines to enter the plans mode, hit them again. We're gonna hit add. And I'm just gonna call this uh, heart and soul how about that heart and soul <laughs> uh, so i've got the start guiding turned on i've got automatic meridian flip turned on um, so this is pretty cool i want to start and instead of starting right now i'm going to start at a certain time so it's telling me it brings up the current time which is 851 so we're going to start this at uh we're going to start it at nine we're going to give it a little bit for some clouds to pass through. We're going to start this at 10 after 9 and 31 seconds. So done with that. So when do we want to end, it, end the plan? That's pretty cool. Uh, when plan ends, astronomical morning light, or, or end at. So let's pick a time. We're going to end it at 6 o'clock in the morning. So 6 on the nose, done. Okay, uh, so we want to turn the cooler off. Yes, we want to go to the home position. Yes, and we're not worried about uh, the automatic focus. And I don't want to shut down the ASIR because I want to be able to like, log into it to see what's uh, what's transpired. Uh, so I'm gonna hit confirm to that. Uh, for some reason, when I go through, I've noticed when I go through and actually enter the data, I have to type the name back in. So if you have that issue, let me know. Maybe you have to go through all, enter all this stuff in there and then do the name. I don't know. So confirm that. So now you gotta hit this plus sign. We're gonna pick the target. We're in my favorites, heart and soul. That's where I wanna go. And I'm gonna hit the check mark. And this brings up the coordinates. So this next plus button right here, we're gonna tap it. And now it's gonna do our sequence. So. We're going to change this to 480 seconds. We're going to do the hydrogen filter. And we're going to shoot 60 of them. Bid one by one. Press OK to that. Uh, it basically gives me a graph, tells me when they, uh, basically the meridian's going to be at like 3.26 in the morning. That's when it's going to hit the meridian. So that's good there. Uh, we're waiting to start, heart and soul. So we're gonna back back out of it again. And then when these two little gray bars come up, uh, telling me the target and the name and how many, you know, we're 0, 060, it's the first of one and only target that we're gonna do. So basically now all we do is we just hit the shutter button. Um, yes, yes, yes to all those. We already confirmed that, we're gonna hit okay. And basically, down here at the bottom, it says, wait 16 minutes to start. So in 16 minutes, it should slew to the heart and soul, start guiding, it's already focused. Pretty cool, finally figured it out. And I, I kinda like it. I like the ability to be able to tell it when I wanna shut it off and I don't have to do a lot of guesswork at how many subs do I wanna enter in so I'm not taking pictures of the house or the ground or the trees. Anyway, uh, pretty cool stuff. This is just a short video, so thanks for watching. Clear skies and clear minds.